everyone. Now I'm going to teach us a little dance with a bit of a festive spirit to get us in the mood for Christmas. So if you walk with me, you do what I do and we'll soon learn this dance. So we're going to go forward, two, three, kick, back, two, three, together. I hope that you were walking that with me, just in case you went forward, two, three, kick, back, two, three, together. Now the next bit, you're going to go step, kick, step, kick, and then you're going to do four walks in a little circle. Walk, two, three, four. So the whole of that first bit was forward, two, three, kick, back, two, three, together. Step, kick, step, kick, walk in a little circle. So that's half the dance learned. Second bit, you're going to go to your right and you're going to go step, cross in front, step to the side, and then you're going to do a heel tap. So you pick up this foot, you tap your heel with your opposite hand like that. So I'll show you again. Step, cross in front, step, tap. Try that again. Step, cross, step, tap. Good. Now go the other way. Step, cross, step, tap. So do both of them up to speed. Step, cross, step, tap, step, cross, step, tap. Then we're going to end with four step taps. So you're going to go step, tap, step, tap, step, tap, step, tap. And that is the whole dance. So it's a really easy one so everyone in the family can join in. So we'll walk it through one more time and then we'll do it with the music. So walk it with me. You're going to walk forward, two, three, kick, back, two, three, together. Step, kick, step, kick, round in a little circle. Step, cross, step, tap, step, cross, step, tap, step, tap, step, tap, step, tap, step, tap. Step, tap. So let's give it a go with the music. I've chosen something a little bit festive for us today, so I hope that you enjoy it. And I hope to hear some people singing along with the music. Again, forwards, back, 
done everyone. So I hope you enjoyed that little festive dance to get you in the mood for a Scottish country dancing Christmas. So now we've got warmed up, we're going to practice doing a step that we've done before and then we're going to learn a new step. So our first step that we're going to practice is called skip change. Now we have done this in one of our earlier videos but we'll do a quick refresher in case you've forgotten or in case there's anyone new watching. So what you're going to do is you're going to start with your right foot and you're going to step forwards. So step. Then you're going to close your left foot behind in a T position, close, and then we're going to step again on our right, step. Now bring the left foot through and we're going to repeat that. So you're going to do step, close, step. So if I shuffle backwards, you're going to do step, close, step, and step, close, step. So I hope that you're walking those with me as I talk them. So we're going step, close, step, step, close, step, step, close, step, step, close, step. Now we want to make that a bit more exciting. So what we're going to do is add a hop at the beginning. So we're going to go hop, step, close, step, hop, step, close, step, hop, step, close, step, hop, step, close, step. Do you want to do that one more time before we practice with the music? Ready, and hop, step, close, step, hop, step, close, step, hop, step, close, step, hop, step, close, step. So I'm going to put some music on for us to have a practice. Now, if you're by yourself, it's nice and easy because you've got all of the space. But if you are dancing with other people, you might want to do a big circle so that you don't bump into each other. So just make sure that whatever you do, you're doing it safely. So we're going to practice our skip change. Hop, step, close, step, hop, step, close, step. So let's put some music on. Ready, and hop, step, close, step, hop, step, close, step. And have a little rest. Ready, and... The next thing we're going to do is we're going to learn a new step. Now this step is a Highland dance step and we're going to use it because it looks a little bit fancy. So it's actually a really easy step because it's called points. So all I want you to do is take your right foot and point it forwards. Now you're going to spring onto your left foot so that your left foot's pointing forwards. Spring like that and spring again, spring and spring and spring and spring. So to make this look really good, think about your feet. What we don't want is banana toes sticking upwards because that doesn't look as good. Point your toe all the way down to the bottom so that we've got a nice stretch. So try that again. Put your right foot in front to start and we're going to go spring, 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 spring. Shall we have a go at doing that to the music? Doing eight springs and then we'll add something else. Ready and spring, 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 spring. And again. Spring, 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 spring. spring. So that's points. 
But what we're going to add to that is some fancy arms. Now, our arms are going to be up in what we call fifth position. So this is having our arms up, about a head width, shoulder width apart, up in the air. Now we don't want them to be all floppy and in. We don't want them to be out. Nice shape up here. Now what we're going to do with our hands is we're going to make deer. And because this is Christmas, they're going to be reindeer. So what you're going to do, you take your hand, copy what I do, you're going to take your thumb and your middle finger and you're going to put your thumb on the second joint of the middle finger and leave the other two, other three even, sticking up. So this is our deer and on the other hand, thumb to the second joint of your middle finger, leave the others sticking up. So this is our deer and when we do our arms in fifth, we're going to have our deer hands and the deer want to be looking at each other. So now if we put that with the points, when we do our points, we put our arms in fifth and we're going to go point, 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 point. And all the time you're doing that, your arms stay nice and up, not coming in and hitting yourself on the head, but staying nice and high in the air while you're doing those points. And that's going to take a bit more energy for you to do. So we'll do a practice with the music and we'll have eight points rest, eight points rest. So get yourself in position. Let's get ourselves ready, hands up. And spring, 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 spring. And another go, ready, and point, 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 spring, point, spring, point. Let's have one more go. Point, 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 point. So that is points, and it's a really easy step to do, but it looks really fancy, and it's going to add the finishing touch of festive sparkle to our dance. Hello and welcome to the dance section of our video. Rebecca has just taught you how to do your reindeer hands and we're going to use those in this dance that she's made up for you. So it's a dance that's going to tell the story of Father Christmas and he delivers the Christmas presents all around the world with his reindeer pulling a sleigh. So the dance is going to have four elements that are going to be the presents, going around the world, being a reindeer, and being a sleigh. So I'm going to teach you the first two elements and then Peter's going to teach you the second two elements. So the first two bits, the first is a present and the presents are often square aren't they when they're in a box. So we're going to do rights and lefts to be the presents. We'll just walk through what rights and lefts are. Um, so you're going to give right hand to the person opposite you, stop there, you're going to give left hands to the person on the side, you're going to give right hands across, and left on the side and you should end up back where you started. And if there's just one of you or two of you, if you move, you three move out the way, if there's just one of you, you're going to walk across to one point, turn, walk to the next point, turn, walk to the this point, turn and then walk back to where you were. So that's if there's one of you. If there's two of you, you can do a little bit of rights and lefts and pretend there's people. Um, and if there's four of you, excellent, you can do the whole thing. We'll walk that through again. So it's right hand, person opposite, left on the side, right opposite, left on the side. So that's our present. The important thing about the present, it's it's square. So if there's just one of you, do yourself a square. The next bit is round the world, and that's going to be a circle. So if there's four of you, you make a circle like this. If there's two of you, you can make a circle like this. And if there's one of you, you have to make a circle like this. And we'll all do the same with our feet. So there's four of us, and we're going to go round for eight steps and then back. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight. And if you remember from previously, we've done one, two, three, four, five, six step close, but don't worry if you don't. So that's our box for the present and our round the world. I'm gonna hand over to Peter for the rest of it. Right, for the sleigh to work, we need two reindeer. So the reindeer, we're gonna do eight points with your arms, with your reindeer arms as Rebecca's just shown you. So the uh, first man is gonna do it first and then first lady. So first man is gonna start off with his arms up. Hope you can see my hands, if not tough, um, I'm too tall. And you're gonna do eight points. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then he stops and immediately afterwards, first lady does the same. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. After that, that's the reindeer done. We now need a sleigh. To do the sleigh, we're gonna take first hands as first couple, or if you're on your own, just do it by yourself. And we're gonna dance down for eight slip steps and back up to the uh, join in second place. So we're gonna go down one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and back up, joining in beneath second couple. Again, eight steps. Now, second couple are gonna wait for bar one and bar two, and then they're gonna step up on bars three and four. So if we go back up and we do that together, you can watch what second couple do as well. Ready, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and back, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go, that's the whole dance. We've changed positions and we're ready to start again. Okay. So we'll dance it to some music. So we're going to do as many as we can do before we're tired. Um, we're going to put some music on and we'll dance through it as many times and we'll try and shout out the instructions as we go. Um, so we'll just get our music set up. Remember your curtsies and bows. Box first. This is your present. You ready for round the world? Right, first man. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Three, four, five, six, seven, Down eight. Down Down the middle. Step up. Once more. Present. Present. Well. Step close. Reindeer. to do that dance it's quite straightforward so hopefully mums and dads could have joined in as well um, you can re-watch the whole video if you want um, but we hope you've enjoyed that and have a lovely Christmas happy Christmas